Yeah, and thankfully they were able to knock down that fire quickly because it's been hot and it was a little breezy as well today. And after all, it still is so much summer. Olga Spina joins us. It was pretty warm today too, Olga. Yes. Hi, Chris and Rachel. It was a warm day today. I mean, we had numbers in the 90s and in the 100s, and we're actually looking at a pretty warm evening as well. So we are seeing numbers uh, still at 70 degrees in Simi Valley, mid 70s for Woodland Hills as well as uh, other parts of the San Fernando Valley. 69 in Beverly Hills along the coast uh, is, is in the mid 60s in Palos Verdes. We're seeing some low 70s in places like Santa Ana as well as Irvine. 67 in Laguna Beach and some upper 70s for parts of the Inland Empire and uh, very mild in Big Bear City checking in at 59 degrees. So numbers were up well above average for most areas including downtown up to 87 degrees today. Typically 84 is where we should be for this time of year but the heat's going to continue with us over the next couple of days uh, with the excessive heat warning in place across uh, some of those deserts that includes the Antelope Valley starting up tomorrow we're we're also going to see that heat advisory going into effect. That continues also through 8 o'clock on Monday. It includes the mountains of Ventura as well as L.A., the San Fernando, the Santa Clarita Valleys. Temperatures for a lot of these areas in the triple digits or in the upper 90s. So very hot for inland areas tomorrow as well as Monday. And then the winds, uh, the winds have actually calmed from where we were earlier this evening. We had a few showers as well, but now we're seeing that activity to the north and uh, to the the east of us. But as we head into the next few days, especially as we start up into tomorrow, uh, we'll see that chance of getting a few showers across some of those mountains and deserts once again. And high pressure continuing with us also with some very hot temperatures again for those inland spots. So even those overnight lows as you wake up early tomorrow morning, right around sunrise time. This is a look at those numbers. So even some areas, places like Santa Clarita, Lancaster will be in the mid 70s. That's as low as it's going to get. Places like Palm Springs, 84 degrees. And then numbers warming up very nicely by the afternoon hours into the 90s, upper 90s for places like Van Nuys, 102 in Santa Clarita, 103 for San Bernardino, some 70s and some 80s along the coast. Here's a check of that seven day forecast. You can see temperatures uh, will start to drop as we head towards the middle of the week. We even go from upper 90s in the valleys tomorrow to upper 80s by Tuesday. Then we get into the mid 80s by Wednesday. So we'll see a drop in the numbers, but just the next couple of days are going to be very hot. Sunday and Monday in the 100s for the IE. High desert, you will be also into the 100s over the next couple of days, then dropping down into the 90s and then into the 80s. For the mountains, we're looking at some 80s as we head into tomorrow afternoon. So some relief from the heat is on the way, but we're just going to have to hang on there for the next couple of days uh, with still some very hot temperatures. Back to you guys.